here in Anambra State, we are able to see a governor of the people. We are able to see a man that has selfless leader, a man who does not believe in personal aggrandizement, a man of honor who has transformed Anambra State. To me, I will not be surprised that he has transformed an Anambra State, knowing his pedigree, and knowing that on two occasions he was kicked out of the government house, and on two occasions he returned. So he shared it the Anambra people, and he has performed well. We are able to see the network of um, roads in Anambra, not limited to the capital, because in some situations, developments are limited to the capital. But here in Anambra State, development, particularly that of road network, is all over Anambra State. And that is highly commendable. Also, we are able to see the enormous resources that have been committed in the areas of education, health, and other very important sectors in the society. This deserves a lot of commendation, and the government has performed very well. The university, the secondary education, the primary education, we visited so many of these projects that I cannot begin to count, but my uh, NUG counterpart has said a lot of those um, I mean government, I mean um, projects that we talked. Your Excellency, I know that you are a 